Oh! Oh! oh. Corn will never be yeah. the same. Let's boil the too. Death by corn water. Death by a thousand cobs. Hey, Petty Pumpkins, it's Chain. And Wes. We're back, and we are so excited to share our commentary of Pearl with you. Mother has finally arrived oh on the channel. Oh my god, we're at the farm, y'all, <laughs> and we are ready for Pearl and all of her shenanigans. We recently watched X and had a blast with that. We're so excited for what Ty West has in store with Maxine. Oh my god, Maxine, it's coming. Hopefully this year we don't know for sure. We don't? Well, I don't think so. We don't, oh we definitely don't know a date. And we don't have trailer. That's disturbing. And we need it desperately. I think about it as soon as I wake up in the morning and while I'm falling asleep at night. Oh, same. Hopefully it's coming soon, but in the meantime, we're trying to tide y'all over and us over by watching Pearl on the channel. And y'all, this is legitimately one of our all-time favorite movies. Oh, favorite ever. movies, favorite performance. I'm like, just so excited to experience it again. It's been a little bit. Yeah, and we have been wanting to watch this since it came out because mm -hmm. when we saw it for the first time, we were like immediately taken. It was both of our favorite movie of mm -hmm. 2022, and it's just like the fact that we are here now. It's big. It feels it's a great. Big moment, and we are so excited to share it with you. But if you want to watch this video in full length format, you can do so by joining our Patreon. It'll be in the $5 Party Pumpkin tier. See y'all at the patch. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Let's go watch Yo, Pearl. I'm obsessed with this movie. And you're literally wearing oh. a pearl sweatshirt. Yes, shout so. out to my sister. She got this for me for Christmas last oh year. Oh my god. So cute. What a queen. Um, I don't even wear it very much because I'm so scared that something could I happen know. to it. So, you know, this is important. I brought her out. She's she she deserves it. You know, the world needs to She's see her. Having her moment. I love her. So, let's let's celebrate Pearl. A24 Presents. That's, like, I love seeing that. It's as soon as you tell me a movie is produced or distributed by A24, I will watch it. Like, foot in the door. Literally gorgeous! So scenic. Like, this is the dream. Pearl has made the dream home. Pearl is the dream. <laughs> She's the dream mother. She's a star. Oh, my God. There's our mother! Oh, stage is set. I really could just watch a whole movie of her doing this, swear to god. <laughs> I, I literally it. could. Even in the darkest times, Pearl shines. Oh, we've all been here. <laughs> yeah. In our mother's dresses or heels. Well, if it's old, then does it really matter? Mother, she's gonna get to her chores. Like, you haven't given her a second. That's so sad. She just woke up. You won't even let her wear her dresses. Like, she does not want her to have any luxury. None. One day you'll never see me again. But I'm love may be it for you, but it's not for me. That's what my shirt says. Wow. <laughs> so cute. I'm special. So true, queen. You are special, girl. When she finds out, won't she? Oh. How does Mother not see the star quality radiating off of her? Oh, she's gonna see it radiating soon. <laughs> yeah, the One blood splatter. The whole world's gonna know my name. They will. Hey, don't you, Mary? They really will, bro. Producer Mia. Wow. Round Love of applause. To see that credit. That's right. And she's a writer on the script. She's literally developing I this character. You deserve a good audience, girl. She's talking about the gays when she says a good audience. Gays that she slays. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she could murder us. <laughs> you know, we're yes queening on the way out. Stick a pitchfork in me, girl. A star. Is born. <laughs> yes. Oh, she doesn't like to be upstaged. Oh. No one told the goose. You don't upstage Pearl. Someone is coming for her spotlight. Well, I would be threatened too because the goose is giving star quality. So she didn't need to resort to what she did, but I understand it. But I hate to watch it also. <laughs> ah! 
<laughs> I love that though, like that. The yeah. crescendo with the, the script credit. Their wild ass minds came up with this movie. That's what I'm saying, like, the creative juices were flowing. Mm -hmm. And to say that they were cooking, it doesn't even feel like enough. Well, when you come off of X and they were, like, really, juices were really flowing mm -hmm. in X, you know, mm -hmm. so they just kept squirting on over to the sequel. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And thank God for those squirts. Speaking of squirts, I cannot believe this is Bobby Lynn's oh. resting place. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. Thank you, Pearl. Literally, like, I just sit here and take it all in. It's my favorite title card ever, I think. It's just so action-packed. Wow. And, like, obviously it's, you know, it's been said, but, like, the way that they edit it, like, it's one of the old movies from this time period. It's just Definitely. gives it so much, like, creative flair. It feels textured. Mm -hmm. Selfish is what it is. With all the farm hands gone, I can't do everything I want to myself. <laughs> She's like, sounds like your problem, Mom. Why did she say go fetch your father like he was in the barn? I th I was like, fully thought she was about to go outside and get his ass. It's like, Pearl probably really doesn't help her at all. No. I, she's she, out putting on plays in the barn. Of course, but she's trying her best. They really set this family dynamic up so well. Mm -hmm. Instantly, mm -hmm. the uneasiness, the tension. Is... It's time, Father. Well, they're all three doing like such different things because Mia's like operating out of ten, and then the father is obviously giving nothing, but so much, but so much, and then mother is also giving well, everything she's... but nothing. Must I say she's mothering? She's mothering. Maybe a little strictly, but... I may get caught up, and I may talk shit about mother in this video. I'm gonna try not to, because when you really try to put it into perspective about that Pearl is her daughter, then it kind of makes sense why she's so, like, oh. on the verge of losing it. Totally. Um, but I'm just saying, sometimes I just get a little heated when mother mm. comes for mother. I'll turn the heat up when you're talking about mama. <laughs> My precious Pearl. It feels as if it has been an eternity without you. All we do is walk, it seems. I find it most frightening at night in the trenches. Mortar shells are definite. I have questions about Howard, though, because how much of Pearl did he know before? Like, surely she was showing oh, signs. He probably has no clue how deep her well goes. Maybe not how deep, but he knows the well is there. I bet you. Mm -hmm. And he stays with her. You know, we love a man that takes his woman for who she is. It's also kind of odd that she chooses to share this information with her dad. Well, she probably feels kind of guilty about it, and so she needs to talk, but yeah. he, you know, he can't do anything, so. Slurp it, daddy. <laughs> oh, stop. My God. No. I'm sorry, he can't be daddy. He has I to mean, be he's father. Literally, okay. <laughs> I can't. I can't daddy him. And this whole situation is so odd. I love how Pearl is so confident in her own potential. Yeah. She's like, has no, no concerns. Maybe they're all just really close, but this feels so exposing. Papers are warning of an lethal resurgence. What forbid sickness returns to normal? See, and then, like, again, it makes sense why she's so straight, because obviously he got sick, so yeah. it all makes sense. But you gotta let a girl have a little fun now and then, yeah. mother. She's gonna have a little date with the Scarecrow sooner or later. <laughs> well, she does deserve a night out with Mr. Scarecrow now and then. The way when we first saw this, it felt so triggering to see her in a mask. Yeah, and also timely. History repeats itself. Yeah. And, like, somehow the mask makes her look more sinister. Mm. Like she's about to operate on you while you're awake <laughs> and, like, cut your stomach open or something. Um, and she's also drinking medicine out of a bottle while she's operating on you. Yeah. Yeah, that's the vibe. I need to know, how many milliliters did she drink? Probably literally dosage? half. And then like was she shocked. Was chugging. Half in shock that her mom found out. Wow. But, like, listen, I believe Pearl could do this. I think so, too. She could do it. I believe in her. 
Like, I'm sorry, but these girls aren't even that good. No shade, but I'm just, I'm just saying, Pearl Damn. could keep up, okay? I'm a stand for my girl. I'm going to argue her point. Any of the descendants of those ladies, get in the comments <laughs> and let them know what's up. If y'all descendants are in the comments, <gasps> you can come for me. Speaking of coming for me, <laughs> the projectionist. Oh, Cigarette? Suddenly I smoke. Yeah. I like the movies? I like dancing. Uh, future tiller girl. Wish. Why not? You're pretty enough. Father's infirm, so I have to help at home. I'm sorry to hear that. Stay there for just one minute, will you? Oh my god. I'm like my. I'm glad I'm not standing because my knees would buckle, buckle. beneath me. Honey, I would be at the movies every day, oh, every show. Yes, bankruptcy. From what you just said, he probably does You're this sure to every girl. Mm -hmm, sure. This is his thing. Wow. Notice once I splice it back together. You know, caring for your family during these times is admirable. You ought to take pride in that. Don't forget to live your life too. I wouldn't mind seeing you up on that screen one day, Mrs. <gasps> Pearl. Mrs. Pearl. Mrs. Pearl. Mrs. Well, Projectionist. Come back. Knock on this door. I'm always here, and well, I can run the pictures as much as I want. <gasps> oh. Thank you. I will. Mm. And she means it. Her prowess. She mm. rolled up. He gave her a frame. Told her to come watch a movie anytime she wants. Mm. Basically hitting on her. Who wouldn't fall for the cinema man? Well, who wouldn't fall for her? A match made in heaven, I suppose. God. Uh. Really. That really was not smart of her to do, oh, though. She didn't cherish it. Like, it was fully half sticking out, it, Pearl. Like, okay, but why would it be deep in the cornfield, <laughs> girly? <laughs> well, I'm just thinking about that she left her bike in the road. I'm thinking about she's getting lifted as we speak. Well, <laughs> there's just a lot going on with this situation. Girl. Oh my god, but her hair is so cute, and those overalls are just... She must have been real turned on by that projectionist because she literally claws her way through this cornfield mm -hmm. for some dick. <laughs> well, I'm surprised she didn't just get a piece of corn and get to work, you know? Mm -hmm. Straw. This scarecrow is fucking scary to me. It is quite frightening. <laughs> like... Someone should dress up as this, this scarecrow family. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I'm the sorry, way but... the feet are positioned. Ah! It's like they're, like, broken, you know? Mm -hmm. oh. oh, and when Melissa McCarthy said climb that like a tree, this is exactly what she meant. Mm. <laughs> That's this is, this is me and Jacob Alordi. <laughs> um, excuse me. <laughs> Looking up at him. He looks like a dead man. Literally. Wow. Like an embalmed dead man that they're now no, using literally. as a scarecrow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the way his mouth hangs down. Ew, I know. Like he's gooning. <laughs> she is... Oh. I mean, yeah. Girl, I, I don't know about all that, though. Like, if the tongue comes out, I'm gonna be so concerned! <gasps> oh, she's... <laughs> she did it! She tongued it! She's tonguing that. <gasps> Ooh, girl. I mean, relatable. Girl, that tongue, you better go <laughs> scrape it. You are, girl, but, you know... <laughs> Tell yourself that, mama. I'm married, but let me go fuck this scarecrow real quick. <laughs> we won't tell anyone we swear. Yeah. Keep it secret, scarecrow. We're not telling, so if someone... Te if anyone finds out, it's because he told. Oh, and he definitely told. Look yeah. at him. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if Pearl told, honestly. Oh, she quite literally tells it herself. <laughs> that bitch so. cannot keep her mouth shut either. Or her legs. <laughs> Are her moans. <laughs> I truly remember the first time that we were watching this in theaters. <laughs> Girl. I'm laughing because I don't know how else to respond. You gotta watch out. Like, what if a, a straw <laughs> went up in her? Oh, you know, yeah. Prickly. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what I was gonna say. Mama's gonna have to. Oh. I don't know what she'll do, but she'll get it taken care of. What took you so long? Far right, Mama. Girl, you've been gone all day. It's on your head. Found it along the road. She got caught. Do not bring it inside. It may be covered in germs. It probably is, girl. She's lucky she doesn't say shave your head right here. When you finish, your father needs change. Don't let him sit in his mess. But was he already sitting in it, girl? Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like he is, and she knew, and that's not good. 
There's no room for even the tiniest lack of precision in a true plot that I can only imagine he must want a lobotomy so oh, bad. Well, sitting there listening to her day in and day out talk about her deepest, darkest secrets. I wouldn't be shocked if she gave him one. <gasps> you know? Yeah. Whoa, this was when I was like, Pearl is sinister. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is when you were like, Pearl is sinister. Yeah. Got it. Okay. This made me feel <laughs> uncomfortable. Well, yeah. Obviously the stuff before. Well, it's like... That's wicked. Yeah, it's really wicked. And then they're both so vulnerable, being naked, and which adds like, an extra layer. She has, like, no consideration. He's still in there. Can he blink twice or something? Like, he needs to give her a sign. Please. This <sighs> actor, though, is so good. How tight is she crushing? I'm telling you, she's... Crazy. She literally was popping Jesus. his neck. To Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen, girl. Amen, mother. Mama, this meal looks delicious. <laughs> Is it vegetarian? Something tells me she's not super considerate about that. No. There's the rest of the money I lent you. What? No. I can count, bro. There are eight cents missing. Honey, inflation. You've gotten some hard candy for the trip, huh? Eight cents is a lot. She thought mother wasn't going to notice. Well, eight cents back then is like eight yeah, bucks. Yeah, you know? that's what I'm that was your supper. The food I worked hard to prepare alone is not. Okay, this is where she Mom, becomes I like... Mom, all that way. I'm starving. You may have what's left of it in the morning. I did not excuse you from the table. Well, but like, isn't Pearl like 25 or something? I would be like, girl, you can't tell me what to do, mother. Okay, so... She has to sit there and watch you eat? No. She wants to teach her a lesson. The one she catches the fish on fire. Which is really sad because we literally, we can't be on Pearl's side with this. Like, the mom is obviously so correct, you know? Mm -hmm. But it's like, it's her cold demeanor. Yeah. So it like icy. sets Pearl up as like you're rooting for her somehow. Yeah. And like part of me wonders if this mom is like jealous of Pearl's ability to be hopeful and have aspirations and dreams and like she never got to oh. have that so she wants to diminish any little flicker yeah. of happiness and Pearl inside star of power. her. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Pearl is like literally a bright shining star and mother wants to suffocate it. Yeah. She wants to snuff her out. Mm-hmm. Well, someone's gonna get snuffed, mama. Somehow make it far, far away from this place. The American dream. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Oh. Hello. Oh, that was utterly disturbing. <laughs> I love that what she's wearing looks like the porn that they were filming in X. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very true. I feel like that was we love intentional. A parallel. Yeah. Like, swear to God, that's exactly what Mia was wearing yeah. in X. It's like Pearl and Maxine were living parallel lives. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. The mother oh. convention has <laughs> arrived. Miss Mitzi. Mother Mitzi. Afternoon, Pearl. Hi, Mitzi. I like your dress. Oh, oh thank you. <laughs> Feels wonderful. To She's so you. fabulous. I love her. But someone called Peter on that. <laughs> well, we were a bit worried about the both of you being out here all alone, so we brought some food and a new letter somehow. Mother has been riddled with worry. If only his pride hadn't gotten him involved in this dreadful war. You know, we had a doctor hmm. willing to declare him ineligible. Anyway, oh, couldn't be me. He's an upstanding. He knew Pearl was not mentally well, and he got the fuck out while he could. Hoping she got herself in enough trouble while he was gone that he could come back and not deal with her. Did he really know anything about her? I need to know the truth. Let's hear his side. The fact that the mom won't take the pig. It's so fucking annoying. I just take the pig, mom. Mother would throttle me if she knew I was planning on attending. There's a dance audition this Saturday at our church for a Christmas chorus line. Word is, they're putting together a troupe. The desperation. we in seven different cities before the year ends. Don't that sound exciting? I'm so nice to be a part of it. Oh. So would I. We should go together then. Sister-in-law of the year, honestly. I mean, really. This is a girl's girl. It'll be our secret. She just wants what's best she for the girls. Got three more pigs She's to drop off this beautiful. afternoon. But at the same time, this is all kind of her fault. She sends Pearl on her spiral. Exactly. Inadvertently. 
She leaves her clutching her pearls. <laughs> yeah. Mitzi is a good role model for Pearl. She's a shining light. She could have been a friend to Pearl. She, I think Pearl is threat. Well, she obviously is threatened by Mitzi, but you know, Mitzi's also a star. But I heard that her hair isn't even naturally blonde. And this is some Sid ass shit from Toy Story. I never noticed that. What is she doing with her dolls in little broken parts? I wouldn't be surprised if she's Frankensteining that shit. <laughs> The vision is clear. She knows what is possible, what can be. A vision and pearl. Oh yeah, you gotta be sneaky when mama's around. I feel like that's the only interaction we see of them together. Yeah, that's like the only time that she is shown taking care of him. And she's mama. not even taking care of him, she's doing something else and yeah. taking him with her. <gasps> that bitch is quick though, I would be mm -hmm. scurrying around the house too. She can never do anything right by mm -hmm. her. That's why she burns her with corn water. Wow. There she is. This is, like, where was the Oscar for costumes? Mm -hmm. They didn't know the impact that they were making when they put her in that dress. We felt the impact, though. Oh, we were, qu it was a mother quake, literally. We had to stop the showing because we thought that the ground was just going to open up and we're all going to fall in. Most definitely. A mother quake for the ages. She scales this building. Yeah, she's parkouring, bitch. Like, this girl is hardcore. Pearl coring. <laughs> yes. Dun, 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 no. dun, dun, Literally, The Wizard of Oz is written all over this movie. Mm -hmm. The way that she rides her little bike to this dick appointment. Mm -hmm. She rode her bike right up to the door, basically. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised she didn't say, hop on, boy. Let's go oh, for a ride. Truly. I love that he basically takes her to his bedroom. Well, yeah. They both know what's going on, oh, you know. And? I can't believe you get to see the pictures every day for free. Mm, not a bad gig, huh? Not at all. He's so gentlemanly. Mm -hmm. I've been thinking a lot about what you said to me the other day. About not forgetting to live my life. Well, there's a dance audition coming up at the church. But I've never really danced in front of anyone before. They need to just I stop showing him because I won't listen to a word she yeah, says. I'm sorry, Mia. I want to. I don't let anything stand in your way. <gasps> what would you like to see? She took that to heart. You saw that already. How about something different tonight? How about... He took this to the next level. Well, she showed up for a dick appointment. He literally is like, hey, what do you want to watch? Let me put on some fucking porn. Exactly. It's something that she has never probably even thought of before. I laid my head on that pillow from time to time, but I wouldn't say I live anywhere in particular. Girl, take that pillow home with you. It's like a dream. Just as long as I can keep from waking up. Well, then who's taking care of the place when you're gone? Yeah, good question. Who's running the films? I have questions about that. Projectionist. Interesting. Maybe he's not so reliable. To be given a private screening by the projectionist? Yeah. Nothing gets better than that, babe. The porn projectionist. <laughs> yeah, that's who he really oh, is. God. I mean, is this considered assault? I mean, did she consent to watching I, I, this? Yeah, I mean, no. Which, y'all, we actually have a story to tell you about. This scene in mm -hmm. particular. Mm -hmm. Do we tell I, it right now? I'm like, do we pause it? Do we tell it? Okay. Oh my god, okay. Y'all. Whenever we first saw this movie, we saw it in theaters, and there weren't a lot of people in our screening, but there was a family that came. You probably will tell this quicker than I can. Wrap it up. Okay. And basically, just tell the story. I'm like, I'm literally Still, cringing out yeah. of my mind thinking about it. Okay, y'all, so this family of literally, it was like five or six comes in. Mm -hmm. The oldest one was pro like maybe ten, okay? The youngest one, a literal infant in a stroller, okay? So they all come in, like, right before the movie starts, and we're sitting, like, not even in the front. We're, like, a few rows up. I don't know why, but the mom comes up to us. My husband dragged us here. My kids are really well behaved, so no worries. Like, if if anything happens, if the baby starts crying, I'm going to take it out immediately. And we were like, <laughs> okay. Take it. Whatever. I don't remember what she said. Something like that. <laughs> she said that she was taking the baby out, if, if need be, okay? So we're like, okay, cool. This is cool. And so then it was, like, kind of weird because they all had, like, 
cups that they brought. They brought, like, a, a cooler in, basically. And the dad would have his drink and then fill up all their cups and then go back to the fountain and fill his cup up and then fill up all their cups. Right. He did this, like, four times. But they weren't all sitting next to each other. Like, two of them were, like, sitting over here and then the dad and one of the other they ones were over here and spread. then the mom and the newborn were in a different mm-hmm. spot. Like, spread throughout the theater and he's, like, getting up and, like, pouring them drinks it was so weird. Okay, so then the dad gets up and, like, goes to the bathroom or something right before this scene. And then the mom, the baby starts crying. And so the mom takes the baby out. And so these three kids are unattended when this scene comes on. And so we're watching this. We're li- I, I can't, It's like we literally watched this with a group of children. With, a, with three children. They the parents have no clue. No clue because they came in both of them after, after the scene was over. over. So unless the kids were like, "Hey, we just watched porn," they they will never <laughs> Which they know. Don't, they don't know what they were watching. They okay, saw ass. So we're literally sitting there just watching this, and we were like, "There's children." And we're like looking around, like, "Is anyone else seeing this?" Never seen anything like that. <laughs> oh, she is invested. She's Trent. ready. She said, bitch, get me a contract. I'm ready to sign it. I'm ready to fuck. She's like eyeing it. Porn really is perfect for her. She loves to fuck and she wants to be in movies. Pearl is a great porn name. Yeah. <gasps> He's adjusting himself, yeah. sir. There's no denying we all share a fascination in seeing people as they truly are. I don't like reality. Well, that's the truth. <laughs> Who does, girl? <laughs> that rocked her world. I bet she went home that night. Oh, and... She went back to that corn cob field. <laughs> I'll tell you that. One day my mother and father will be gone. And be loud, man. Is this Pearl or Dateline? Stay tuned. You only get one take at this life. If you don't make the most of it when you're young, you don't get a second chance. Cutting deep. He's so wise. Everything he says. Die. It's like he's so daddy, but no children. Just me. It's real nice to be able to talk to someone for change being cooped up on that farm for so long sometimes it worries at me i'm not the same as other people <laughs> so she is aware you don't see well she girl. knows she's not well the amount of times he has adjusted i was about to himself, say I'm like, he cannot keep his hands off of his pants like just take them off if you're so antsy, just take them off. The arts are so much more alive in Europe. You can be whoever you want to be there. Well, you right? fucking take her then. You can be in pictures like this. I know, I'd watch you. Oh. It's just like all these well-intentioned people trying to, like, give her hope. I mean, is the hope is him literally telling her she would be a great porn star? <laughs> well, he's saying, live your life, get out of the house, do something. Which is wild compared to Maxine, because that's the, the route that Maxine takes. And well, exactly. That's why Pearl hates her. That's why we have this duo of films. If I was Pearl's mom, I would fucking sit there and cry my eyes out every night. I swear to God. You stroll up and find a dead rooster on the porch or something and you just close your eyes and look the other way and cry at night. Well, I wouldn't be shocked if she saw her daughter writing random things. I don't want to know all the, the things farm. she has seen Pearl do. Writing a pitchfork. The pitchfork, yeah. definitely. I wouldn't be surprised if Pearl's like, let me kill her right now. Honestly, I'm shocked she didn't. To me, it's shocking that Pearl accidentally kills her. True. It's not like premeditated. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But it was a long time coming, girl. Wow, and she is like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and take my daddy to the edge of the pier and put him in the alligator's belly. Well, maybe she's just being kind. Theta! She said, let's end his suffering. Theta, girl. Now, the choice to do it by feeding him to the alligator is questionable. I'm leaving soon. What if Theta had snatched him up? I can't stay here any longer. Howard was supposed to take me away. It'd be easier for me if I didn't feel like I was abandoning you. I love you, Daddy, but this is no way to live. This is so sick. Like, it really shows she has no bounds to her evil. What are you doing? Talking with Daddy? She probably heard everything. Getting back to the house. She certainly did. One day you'll understand that getting what you want isn't what's important. Damn. Making the most of what you have is. Life rarely turns out how you expect you need to be prepared for that. I'm like, honestly, fucking slap that shit on every billboard because she's so right. Get a tattoo, girl. Across the forehead. Remember it. Like, this is the one time that mother has hit the nail on the head. 
With her correctness. She was actually mother. <laughs> yeah, she she truly was, finally. She plays around too much. What are you doing, girl? There is a gator nearby. Mm hmm. And she thinks they're friends, but <sighs> don't trust that bitch. Theta. Oh my god. Right. The fucking eggs. Ooh, I got goosebumps. I hate it. Why, why, why am I so scared of alligators and reptiles? You really are. Like, I hate them. They give me the ick. I showed him this clip of uh, an alligator. Oh. His reaction was, it was so visceral. It was so horrible. And all it was was an alligator eating a cell phone. Right. And I was, like, convulsing. And Thade was going to know she did that. She was oh. probably sitting there watching. <gasps> Ooh. She knows something's up. Stop mm -hmm. staring at me. This is a mother off. Who's going to take charge? There can only be one HBIC in the barn. I love that she's like, I do help you, mother. Yeah. <laughs> this is what she does. This is what she's doing all day. Ooh. <gasps> she is the least lit girl I've ever seen. Just constantly fucking flopping. Um, I am not blind to what goes on once here. Take your dinner. Stay in the bunkhouse. But it's freezing out there. You should have thought of that before putting me at rest. Isolate yourself until we know you're not in. Well, girl, it's already in your house if she has it. There's a dance audition in town tomorrow. I'm going well. Oop. Why? I'm not if I'm good enough. Good enough for what, girl? Ooh. The movies, mama. Let us also some gratefulness stem from. How is it you find our life so beneath It's because you're so cold, lady. Mm -hmm. And I understand her point, but Pearl obviously wants a better life for herself. Yeah. Like, why would you want her to have the same fate as you? Oh. This movie reminds me so much of Carrie, the Brian De Palma Carrie, and this scene is why. In private, you believe no one is watching. You can't keep your true self hidden forever. They will notice eventually, and they will be frightened. Very girl. Mama had her clocked. Uh, probably from childhood. Yeah. I know this girl was killing lizards when she was five. Leaving your mother alone to rot so you can dance with a bunch of silly whores. <gasps> Let alone the illness you may contact and spread. You see what it does to your father? That's what you want for yourself and others? And maybe that is what you wish for me. Oh my god. I can't stand the sound of it anymore. It's so almost as abhorrent as your sinful behavior. You are not one It's only a matter of time before you hurt someone else. And I will not in good conscience let you leave this farm again. But honey, you conjured all this out. Mm-hmm. She should have said something a long time ago. She's just been letting her do it. I showed her a burden you would never understand. Spend my days feeding and wiping the snot off the face of the man I married. You dare sit there and talk Till death do us part, bitch. Heard of it? Pearl didn't oh, well. sign till death do us part. Pearl's like, Oh, she's so good too. I feel like no one really talks about her performance that much, but she's amazing. Suffer for you any longer. You want to leave? Go. But when you fail, and you will fail, mm. I want you to remember what it feels like because that's how I feel every time I look at you. She I cut deep with that one. I just don't want him to block you, is all. Oh, <laughs> damn. Like, bitch, it's a dragging convention, okay? You just dragged her, she dragged you back, mom. She's just telling the truth. Like, how are you gonna talk to her like that? Oh, and then expect her not to retaliate. <laughs> so that's what it is. Oh! Oh! Corn will never be yeah. the same! Let's boil the bitch too. Death by corn water. Death by a thousand cobs. So her saying, you're not better than me. She, you know, maybe felt she was better than Pearl because she was more of a nurturing woman. Mm -hmm. and more feminine, more motherly, more, yeah, she does what she's supposed to do. Considered Pearl to be a whore. Yeah. So.
But I'm on I'm pro side, you know. Same, same. Girl, same. Mama. Sorry. <laughs> Me again, hey. Mm -hmm. She is one lucky girl. Yeah. You know, her life certainly goes downhill after this, but she got one good one in. What one night of bliss. Yeah. This is us clapping for her because she got that D. <laughs> Great job, mother. All the gays cheering. And it was good. Look at her. I'm sorry, Howard's not giving that. I guess you could say he's Superman to that home. <laughs> yeah. I think so. It's certainly a Superman. Oh, mother. Mommy Fearest. I think she's looking good still. I like it. Did she have an alarm set? She was risking it all. An alarm set? It's 1918. They still had alarms. Did, Did they? 6 a.m. yet. I have to practice my routine. You forgot this last time. Glad you came back. I did not need to know what he looked like in bed because that was fucking mean, Ty. Okay, yeah, that was mean. He's so dreamy. He's such a gentleman. Fucking Pearl. The one thing I'll never forgive her for is that she took him away from us. That's the I one know. thing I hold against her. <laughs> Any dead bodies around still? Just the rotting pig on the porch. She left him. He probably thought he was going to sit there and starve yeah. to death. Yeah. Girl, just give him the whole body. Yeah. Uh, the whole body. <laughs> well, sorry. Yeah, it's it's because he popped up no. on the screen and I uh, got my words a little confused. Please step away from the maggots. The mags need to stay away from David Corn Sweat, the projectionist. Mm -hmm. I swear to God, he's up there for me with like Christian Bale and American Psycho and Jude Law and Mr. Ripley. It's so tragic where we barely get him. Mm -hmm. Girl. I mean, yeah, you know. I get it, but. That doesn't seem so bad. What was that? Girl, aren't you supposed to be Don't practicing your dance? Exactly. Like you said, digmatized. Whatever it is, we can't just ignore it. it could be your father, I mean, for you sake. could. It's not my father. Please don't go. What's the matter with you? Yikes. He fucked up with that. <laughs> yeah. He should have said, oh, I forgot. I have something I have to do. Mm -hmm. But he you got so sussed out and then started acting sus himself. You really, you don't have to get involved. Mm -mm. Getting involved never ends well for anyone. Ever. There's so much trauma surrounding corn. Yes. It's her dog. She made a mess in the kitchen while I was away, so I put her in the root cellar. Girl. You think you're oh, slick. She cannot read the room. No. Like, she, she should have sent him, like, oh, I need to get ready, you can go Oh, get yeah. him out of there. I named each of them after my favorite picture stars. Ruby sad to say goodbye, but like they say, if you're not moving forward and show business, you're moving backwards. Oh, she's so smart. More animals, but they all died. <laughs> she killed him. <laughs> By your hand, girl. What's its name? We don't have a dog. I thought you said you uh, did. You just said it. Seller. Like, girl, just said it. She's probably been sipping on the morph. Oh, boy. Oh, I better... You should have oh boy in a long time ago. Yeah. As soon as you saw the corn on the floor, you oh boy it. Nice seeing you, bro. Oh. Did I do something wrong? No, nothing. This is my favorite part. Then why did you just go cold on me? Oh, she can read the room. Finally. But she did. She did feel it. What did you see? I didn't see anything. <laughs> that eyebrow raise. Yeah. Yes. Oh. I know because I feel things very deeply. <laughs> and now her eyes like almost like sunken in or something. When? Like. When will I see you? I don't know, Pearl. It's just an expression. You're not going to take me to Europe, are you? Tell me the truth. What did I do wrong? Come. No! Why are you leaving me? If I don't do anything wrong, I don't understand. I thought you liked me. I do. Yeah, just Tell me the okay. truth. Why are you leaving me? What did you see? Why did you change? Girl, he you saw it all. He saw everything. Best luck with your Don't let her know you're scared. Okay. Let him go. He's too cute. Mia. I know people say that's like all she does or something, but like, she's so fucking good at it. And that's not all she does. We'll talk about that in a minute. I'm just saying she's great at that character. You're not gonna leave me here. Oh. I'm not Well, girl, don't you think that he could have been your ticket out? Exactly. She should have escaped to Europe with him and then killed him. She didn't play her cards right. No, she did this all wrong. She could have rode that dick for a while longer. Oh, sir. <laughs> that scream, though, that's one for the ages. 
right through the throat. Mm-hmm. Just how we like it, you know. I mean, in a sense that. Oh, mama. Meatloaf, mama. <laughs> no. She's like a charred chicken. Oh, he's scared. Mm-hmm. And that's what I'm saying about this actor. Like, he does such a good job of conveying so much emotion. And just his eyes. There she is. Did Ty and Mia know they were making literal fucking history? <laughs> Herstory with this dress? Yeah, you pack up and you leave, girl. You go get that new life. <laughs> yeah, she's ready to go. She said, I'm not coming back. Just one little thing I have to do first. What do you think? Tears of joy. Yeah. He probably thinks he's better off just sitting there, honestly. And he's probably right. But it's like, by now, after everything he's seen and been through, this is the kindest thing that she does. I mean, at least it's humane, right? Yeah, at this point, yeah. To a certain extent. This wallpaper. I'm, oh my god. The blood on the windshield is a nice touch. <laughs> That's one of my favorite lines in this whole movie. She's like, next. Yep. She's like marching like a soldier oh almost. Oh my god. Man, Theta got to eat him up before we did. That's so sad. That lucky bitch. She gets to eat everyone. She's eating. Mother has arrived on the scene. Everyone, shoo shoo. I wonder what Pearl's writer is. I have a feeling she has a list of demands. A pitchfork? <laughs> when we first watched this, I thought surely she was gonna kill them. Yeah, I definitely thought that too. But what comes is much better. Yeah, no, I'm glad she didn't. That would have been too obvious. Hey, don't touch the shoulders. They have been puffed. Mm -hmm. The designer puffed. is not gonna be happy to hear about this. I love this whole outfit. I think she looks fucking stunning. I think it's giving command oh. on the X. X marks the spot. I think she's giving X factor. Oh, chills, bitch. Mm -hmm. She's ready. She said I'm ready. This is her moment. Oh my god, I'm so ready for uh, this. Same. <laughs> she's so... Like, this is a professional woman. Oh my god. She's cheesing. Like, I would pick her. I would too. She has so much energy. But like, Look at her. the other girls weren't doing this. No. It's giving psychotic disco. Like. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> I need to see the other girls who auditioned. This is so genius, the way that they did it. And of course, she's giving me a showcase for another amazing moment. Oh. Because to me, besides the monologue, this is the most memorable moment I of this mean, movie. My country tis of pearl. <laughs> exactly. God stunning, gorgeous. Yes. I would have picked her so fast. I would have said, "You're getting promoted to Europe." That girl don't break your neck now. <laughs> and they're so cold about it. No deliberation. They don't give a fuck. What about the judge's remarks? Yeah. Okay. And is he making the final decision? Because I didn't hear them whisper. I have got to see the Untucked episode. I think you're about to watch Sorry, it. Sorry, you just knocked what we had in mind. Sir? Well, that was the best dancing I've ever done. Let her in. Yes, it was very nice. <gasps> you're looking for something different today. All American. What, what was Some more all American? Blonde. Then, but like my question is, did they say we want a blonde person? Because otherwise they're just wasting everyone's fucking time. Just say we want a blonde Next. bitch. I am afraid so. Harsher than anything Simon Cowell ever said. You don't understand I'm in this. Next in line, please. Come on, Donnie, I don't want to make a scene in spot. Um, I think she does. I'm a, I'm a star. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Let me know. You're a what? No! Wait, I don't, I don't see Emma Stone here. <laughs> Emma Stone? She's not here, honey. <laughs> Get this girl medical attention. It honestly is so sad. Like, she was so... It really was her only chance. Like, she, back then. I mean, her only chance. Well, she fucked up her other chance. She fucked him up good. No way, she's just, like, openly weeping. Does not give a fuck who hears her. And then you have the glowing, radiant Mitzi. She's like the sun. <laughs> Relatable. This is how I feel inside most of the time. Not like this. Your dinner's ready. Oh, bitch. 
<gasps> Eat it up. I'm gonna throw up. Here's your fork. Or you wanna use your fingers, feel the little mags <gasps> crawling Please? around on your hand. No. They like kinda crawl up your sleeve if a little you bit. Don't stop. Mitzi, that should have been your red flag, babe. Yeah, girl, like how the fuck did you even enter? The vibes are off. Mm-hmm. I'm sure you can feel the Should tension. Go fetch your mother? You can fetch a shovel for her grave. I might want to fetch the, the authorities. <laughs> yeah. Fetch the will, babe. Oh, come on now. I know you're disappointed, but there's no sense in taking it this hard. Easy for you to say, know, girl. You know, the first thing about quality dancing. Yeah, what are the qualifications what were their credentials? of the judges? And you know what? Let's see them dance. Yeah. That was the best dancing Pearl ever done. I don't feel well. And oh. she means that in every sense of the word. I snuck out of the house and ended up bringing home nothing but the germ. My mother and father would just kill me. Girl. Well. well. You worry there may be something wrong with me and Mitzi. Seems like there's something missing in me that the rest of the world has. That's called a conscience, sweetie. Howard, pretend I'm Howard, and you just say whatever's on your mind. Y'all, don't invite okay. yourself into these okay. kind of conversations. No. She's too nice. It's... Her niceness got her murdered. Her kindness got her fucked up. Oh my god, here we go. Monologue of the century. And I want to say it now. When people say she doesn't have levels, I say watch this. I implore you to watch it. Let's hear it, Mother. I hate you so much for leaving me here sometimes. I hope you die. Honestly, put it on a disc track. This is slam poetry. I was curious about other men. I'm Girl, sure you speak don't your want to truth. hear about a stranger satisfying you with love, but I swear it was only one. It was a mistake. The projectionist was not a mistake, Carl. Never. You're such a good person, I know that. I never wanted you to feel jealous. It's an awful feeling like a rod, the way it just twists and turns at your insides. I know that aching so well, I feel it. This is the moment that she's like, what the fuck have I done? Yeah. The truth is I'm not really a good person. Ooh. The introspection is very commendable. All my life, I've wanted off this farm, and you were my ticket out. So I made sure to never let you see who I really was. What like a charm too? Mm. She says that, but I feel like she didn't yeah, think her I mom knew anything that's either. That's so right. I'm just saying I'm not convinced. Mama knew what the fuck was up. Her fucking teachers that's knew. That's swear to God, like her pastor knew, her grandmother knew. You just wanted to stay here on our farm, and that made me so angry. Certain you I hated it. He must have. Did he even ask her about her feelings? Probably not. I was even pregnant with your baby. Keyword was. What did she do to her baby? Girl, I don't want I to don't know. I wanted to be a mother. I love the feeling of it growing inside me. And she did not need to be oh, having a child. Sucking on me like some needy animal in a barn. How could I be responsible for another life? Life terrifies me. It's harsh and bleak and draining. And death is it? It's a little less weight keeping me trapped here, but then the war came and you left me too. Why did you leave me, Howard? He got her fucked up. I feel like him leaving triggered okay. at least some of this behavior. What is wrong with me? Please just tell me so no, maybe I can tell her. Don't tell her what's wrong with me. I want to be dancing up on the screen like the pretty girls in the pictures. The pretty girls? I want what they have so badly to be loved from as many people as possible to make up for all my time spent suffering. So many people go through this monologue. Mm -hmm. It's like Pearl is so relatable in a way. <laughs> She's just like us. If only we had like Instagram for her then. Like the gays would be eating her up. She would have found her place. Like she would thrive. Exactly what mama said. I was weak. I'm so scared that when you finally come home, you'll see me and be frightened like everyone else is. I know what I've done. Terrible, awful, murderous things. She said that. First, it was only animals smaller than myself. Till recently, the mom and the boy from the picture house, they were different. I hurt them so they too might know what it feels like to suffer, but poor daddy didn't deserve that. I wish I hadn't done what I did. You went a little far, girl. But you were gonna feed him to an alligator. Mm-hmm. She only wanted a home to feel safe and I can see that. I thought I hated her, but I just want to feel safe too. Well, you destroyed every semblance you had of protection <laughs> and safeness. I need to make things right before you see me again. Keep telling yourself that. I can that. forgive. I can be who you want me to be. Just stay you far. say yes, and then when she's asleep, you get the fuck out. All I really want is to be loved. How is Mitzi still sitting there? She, like, girl, she should have gotten up and ran. I don't think this girl would have even noticed. She has not even looked up for five minutes now. 
<laughs> Mitzi girl, mm. like, what is going through her mind? She's probably like, wow, what an excellent performance. What do you do? Yeah, already would have gone up. Yeah, you have to come up with, like, an explosive up. diarrhea excuse or something and get the fuck I away. Not Will they be wondering? Why Why didn't you think about that before you came? Uh-huh. Are you frightened of me? I love Mitzi, but she handled this so wrong. So bad. Do you think I'm sick? She didn't know she was supposed to be a final girl. She... No. She didn't know. Thank you. <laughs> oh, her look is chilling. It is. Her her eyes yes. have almost no life in them. Oh! For getting the part in Dan's troop, you deserved it. Would you admit it if you got it? No. I didn't get the part. It's okay. But there are people that think that she didn't really get it, but I didn't see any other blonde girls sitting there, so... It wasn't me, I'm glad it was you. I think it was her. But Pearl, I... please, don't lie to me. <laughs> don't do that! Well, yes, thank you. It's gonna be real swell. That was the it's moment that she sweet. decided to murder her. Yeah. This, mm-hmm. Hope you can come see this show sometime. Wrong thing to say. Ooh. Wrong. Let's get everything you want. Thing to say. Yeah. You're younger, I'm a blonde. I have to go now. You're not gonna say anything, are you? No! Oh, no! Gossip! Yeah. Goddamn God word, bitch! Uh, just a chat between friends. I really do love Howard. Oh, yeah. Howard's great. And I believe that because he lives to be yes. 90 years old. Can be our secret, Mitzi. How long would this have lasted, truly? Would she have gone and, like, told her mom? Surely, right? Surely. If she had actually let her go. Yeah. She'd have been arrested. Yeah, quick. Girl, run. Yeah, she should have taken off. Taken off those little heels, those little kitten heels she's wearing, and bolted. This is giving Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Mm -hmm. Bitch. Run mm -hmm. with your little flower petal dress. I love this walk that Mia does too. This is one of my favorite like pearl character moments. Mm -hmm. It's the way her body starts really getting into it. Yeah. Girl, who do you think's gonna hear you? Y'all are deserted, Mitz. If a Mitzi falls in the oh. woods, can anyone hear her scream? No. Ooh. Right into her spinal. I'm sorry, but Jack Torrance could never. Jack Torrance wishes he was this crazy. That's what I'm saying. He wishes he was her. Talk about that rum. Tell her what it is. Hard life lesson to learn. But she always does end up on top. Always. Go have a quality moment with your mama. Time for a precious little moment. <gasps> I can't look at that. Oh, and this is like a parallel to Pearl in X because when she's brushing her hair and it's like the same thing happening. I wonder if that was the same brush. Oh, and there's Mitzi's head. No, please, please, please. I know, I knew it was coming. I can't. Oh. These images are so disturbing. I love how it does this. <gasps> this little split screen thing going on. I don't need to see Mitzi's limbs getting I think it cut just, up. It looks so real. I don't like those images of violence necessarily. But yeah. They, they just look. Even ah! like all this. Mama. <laughs> Okay, th we could have ordered, like, Taco Bell, the party pack or something, yeah. you know, like... Well, she didn't have time. She had to make do with what she had. I got those loaded nachos now. You don't need the loaded pig carcass. And this is just... Foley has to imagine this conversation with her mom. Just to be able to make peace with it. Bless us, O oh Lord, and these thy gifts. Oh, and one thing we haven't talked about, this movie... Honestly, should have had an Oscar nomination it for, should've. well, many Oscar nominations, but yeah. makeup and hairstyling, so Mia Goth. Mia Goth not getting in for Pearl. I feel like she's, like, considered up there with, like, Tony Collette for Hereditary now. Yeah. For being snubbed, for giving, like, definitely, in my opinion, the best performance of the year, 2022. Oh, Howard. Oh, my God, Howard. You're in for a surprise. This is Josh Hutcherson looking ass, bitch. Howard, you're actually cute. He's hot. Pearl? Now I know why she was so mad he left. Mm -hmm. And the fact that he stays with her even after this. If he really wasn't seeing any signs from her before, he's just blindly oblivious. Willfully blind. 
Is that a smoothie? So I don't know what that. Oh, lemonade, probably. I don't want to try Pearl's lemonade. <laughs> Yo, this is my favorite thing ever. Maybe the best thing I've ever seen. No, I think that this is my favorite ending to a movie ever. I think so. Like, I just, I have to sit here and watch the whole thing. We're on Mia Goth Watch. I love that Ty just said, keep going, girl. You do your thing. And she owns it. She does. She falls deeper and deeper into the character. Like, what was going through Mia's head during this? Something horrific. Yeah. <gasps> What a touching little film. <laughs> Truly warms my heart. We did it! Y'all, Pearl will always be that girl and we literally are so ready for Maxine. It is legitimately my most anticipated movie of this year. Me too. Um, and like, just have to throw it out there now, we are gonna go see Maxine in theaters. Yes. We sacrifice a lot of movies that we don't go see in theaters so we can react, but that is one that we will be seated opening day. Yeah, Maxine is one we don't want spoiled. We will be there opening night and... Here's the thing, we will be doing a commentary, so. Sorry. I know that not everyone loves commentaries, but if you're watching this, you probably at least are okay with them. Yeah. So hopefully y'all understand. Of course, we're still going to support these films because we love them. Of course. Wow, we did it. Wow, down in the comments, let's talk Pearl. We wanna know, is Pearl your girl? <laughs> Pearl's always my girl. As always, make sure they all like, comment, and subscribe to Petty Pumpkins and our Patreon. Please do also follow us on all social media at Petty Pumpkins because we want to spill the tea with you. Thank y'all so very much for watching. We love y'all. Stay spooky. But it doesn't say like score. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Pearl. <laughs> oh my God. Whoa, bro. Hell's under new management now. I like my pumpkin spice lattes extra hot. I am going to eat your soul. Sorry, I'm not into short guys.